Hello and welcome. Today we're checking out Tactics 5 Obsidian Brigade. This is a, a fantasy style turn based tactical game being developed by From Nothing Game Studios. Uh, hit Steam about a week and a half ago. Uh, so, what's going on here is uh, similar to something like fan uh, Final Fantasy Tactics. We've got a squad uh, of heroes and we're going to be storming across the countryside, uh, leveling them up and, and sort of uh, specializing each of our, uh, our heroes that are on the team. So I thought we should take a look at this one. It's got a very interesting uh, design style to it. Um, we can also play two-player hot seat if we want to, but no, we're going to play um, the old normal game. I'm going to go into the game I've loaded up, which is basically just past the tutorial bits. So we, uh, we're here at Bandit Pass. We were sent on a mission to go take out some bandits, and now we're going to head into um, into a hideout. I'll go head back to town, basically, and have a chat with the mayor here. So yeah, if you like games like Final Fantasy Tactics, then this is this is basically what this thing is is clearly inspired by. Um, we're gonna have a, a, a team of, of people. We'll take a like take a look at them in a minute. Um, where we can we can equip them different weapons and armor. Uh, they get them all different skills as well. Uh, and there's a bit of a story here. Um, I, one of the things I, I skipped is a big long story. There's some sort of war going on, and we're in this empire of of whatever it's called. And um, we're just sort of a squad of, of heroes, the Obsidian Brigade, they call us. And Marcus is one of the guys in our team. He is our defender. Um, we took care of the bandits. We're talking to the mayor here. Excellent, says the mayor. All thanks to you. Well, you know, we, uh, we do what we can. Uh, Durin here is, our, is one of our fighters. How about our payment, buddy? He says, oh, I'm not forgetting. That's right. I want money. Here you are. Okay, we got some cash. As we go through missions, we'll get, uh, we'll get skill points we can spend on our uh, people as well. Uh, Mayor of Town hires. This is dire te times indeed. Well, might as well try and find another customer. Let's head here into into the tavern and see if we can find someone that wants to pay us for our services. We'll just walk right through people. Doesn't matter if they're on our way or not. All right, this is the prologue. Obsidian Brigade. That's us. So apparently, there's like 25 hours or so worth of uh, of gameplay here. And uh, we'll have like this open map, which we can go on various missions. You know, there's a story, of course, but we can also like bounce around and go whatever way we want. Now, the pack of thieving dogs, given justice, justice as in our blade went through their chest. Thank you, Obsidian Brigade. Thanks, uh, bro uh Frogman Barkeeper. You truly are a godsend. Godsend. I thought only school children clung to those stories. School children and, and some others, to be sure. With the war on, I'm surprised the Church of. Katamunas is the only source of education this side of Oria. Oria, I think, is the uh, continent. How do you view the church these days, Durin? So we have a choice. We we don't respond. We believe, or we don't believe. Uh, we'll just leave. We'll leave that em that empty. Here comes a priest now. Is this the Obsidian Brigade? That we are. I have something to ask of you. There's an abandoned town east of here, where uh, some have sighted undead monsters. Necromancy is an abomination in the eyes of the church, and illegal in the eyes of the law. Would you put an end to this atrocity as a favor to the church? We're interested? Oh yeah, of course I will. Atrocity is my middle name. What are you offering for payment? That's an excellent question. In payments, uh, one of our healing arts instructors will join you on your journey. My name is Eshin. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Well, I'm not going to be a babysitter. And you would continue with us after stopping this necromancer? If you'd have me along. I can also teach you the magic of healing. We shall see. Alright, alright. So we'll bring a, we got a tag along here. That This is my payment? It's a tag along? Well, whatever. Okay, so let's head into uh, Necromancy Land and see if we can take out some skellies. Or whatever that may be. So when we get to combat here, um, we have we have a decent sized party. There's like, like five or six. Oh, here we go. We got there's There's seven of us. Um, and we can we can add more folks into here. We can only add so many. I think we can carry I think four or five. Um, you can also, by the way, use controller for this game. Oh, there we go. We can have five units, minimum of three. So we're gonna bring in. Uh, we'll bring in. What's your name? Oh, we gotta click here. I think your name's Cla Clia. Clia can go in there, and we'll send in. So we got fighter, healer, defender, archer, and uh, we'll send in the rogue. Frithwi. Frithwi, you're gonna go there. Okay, there's five of five. Let's deploy. I think I hit space. We'll click there. Okay. Yeah, Oria is uh, is like our. I think it's like the whole continent. I believe it's either continent or our realm. I'm sorry. I didn't. I didn't pay a lot of attention to the story. I'm just here to kill skeletons. 
Do as you're told, old man, says Remus, with a funny mask. You don't want to taste our daggers. We have a nice bite. Like a snake, because they're poisoned. Yes, but you have to leave something up to the victim's imagination. Oh, I see. I see. Bandit chat. Sorry, Remus, I remember next time. Okay, yeah, yeah. I think we're using... Yeah, yeah, masks. Can I help the boys with something, says Bernard? Yeah. By giving us all your money. And I don't see a staff, so you mustn't be a practicing wizard. Hand over your money, old man. Sorry, I seem to have forgotten what you're selling. I have a poison dagger I could sell. Forget it. Just rough him up and take what he has. Yeah, we've we have teleported in, however. We need business, sir. You seem uh, seem to have dropped your staff behind you. Thank you. You're too kind. One of those uh, are those men bothering you? Oh, I think they're just traveling salesmen selling. Pardon me. I seem to have forgotten what you were selling. We're robbing you. Yeah, yeah. Okay, bandit chatter. We're just gonna kill these guys. Forget the Yammerin. Let's just kill him. Okay, so our job, this mission, is to make sure, I think it's to make sure that green cloaked guy stays alive. Use some amateur thugs. Protect the wizard. He's the blue dot, means keep him alive. And uh, just wrap up these other guys, I guess. So we're going to move around and do our thing. And now we're going to take part in the game. So yeah, weird uh, uh, style here. But we can use uh, Q and E to sort of rotate the map uh, 90 degrees. We can also do a uh, like a top-down view, which actually I like better. Um, and zoom out, something like that, which I think is much easier on the eyes. Uh, we'll leave it here for just a, just a moment. Um, and let's see. So we've got Eshin here is up first. So Eshin has a few things, different things he can do. He can do some spells. He's got just a healing spell. Um, I'm not sure what Meditate does, but he's got hit points. He's got power points, I think is what it's called. Uh, experience skill points for later on. Um, let's just go ahead and move on up to, I don't know, move up to there. So take six of his time units. And um, maybe nothing really to do. Just Just defend. Just and face that way. There you go, buddy. Okay, we got Frithwi. Frithwi. I'm going to switch it over to this, this mode because it just feels better. Alright, let's go move up this way. Scoot on up there. Okay. And uh, can you do anything? You can, you can do a cripple and be stuck into your next attack. Yeah, go ahead and do that. Do we have enough points for that? Sure. We got plenty of points. I think. Okay, yeah. Imbue effect is on you. Excellent. Face towards that rock. Next up is Durin. We saw that guy before in the bar. Let's go ahead and move him up. Let's go, um... I guess we need to go this way. He doesn't move very far, does he? Head up there. And throw a rock. Oh, no. Never mind. Don't throw a rock. Um... I think you're done. You don't, you're only you don't have any techniques yet. We haven't learned anything yet. So, uh... Yeah, yeah. You're done. In turn for you. Face that way. And then we've got Klya. Klya, you can probably do some shooting, right? If I come up stand here... Look who, notice who you put in front line, the healer. Yeah, the guy we don't like. Uh, double shot. Sure, we got plenty of power points or whatever it's called for that. Um, let's shoot nobody because they're too far away. Yeah, he's too far away. He's just out of my red range. So I'm going to have you just, uh, just end your turn. Unless this is further. Nope. Yeah, just, uh, just end your turn. Face that way. Okay. Watch these bandits do their thing. Buildings are just getting in the way. Okay. Thanks, friend. He's taking taking a bit of a beating there. Also, you're kind of in the way. Uh, okay, so if I want to come over here, I'm like, can I get over here in any way? Oh uh, yeah, I can. Okay, let me go switch back right here. Um, let's go back up. Let's we can come up here and stand right here. Stab this guy in the side. Let's do that. So I want to attack that guy. Take that, 30 hit points. Excellent. Keep looking at him. Next up, we got Klya. Klya, uh, you can do that double shot thing, can't you? What about this guy in the back? I'm going to have you that be your job. So I want you to move up to um, here. Make sure he's in range. And your job is going to do that double shot thing. Right there on that guy. There you go. Is that, oh, you fought two arrows in one. Oh, yeah, yeah. Robin Hood. That guy's, oh, okay. Okay, good job. Uh, the old man, by the way, I guess, we don't, I guess we don't have control of the old man. Uh, okay, so healer, I'm going to have you... I don't know, how many hit points? How are you feeling? Can I tell you're... Um, like I say, I, I, I'm not a fan of the camera, uh, to, be, to be honest. 
Um, yeah, you know what? Let's heal that guy. I don't know if how, how he's feeling, but we're going to go ahead and heal him. There you go, buddy. Yeah, yeah. All better? He feels all better. Okay. Um, your turn's done. Uh, you know what? Let me move you back a little bit. Let's just, let's just, not let me, I don't really care about you, but just get back and, and, uh, and don't die, please. So, you have a, um, you also have a steel ability. I think the archer can handle that guy. If I'm going to have you move up to here, I think. Can you attack diagonally like that? I don't know if actually you can. Go there. I don't think you can. Can you attack? You cannot. Um, and you can't do any of that either. So, um, hmm, just end your turn, I guess. We'll have to figure out what we can do here. There's rocks in the way. That guy is what, drinking a potion? Yep. Oh, we got himself some power points. Some mana. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Get out of the way. Thank you. Okay, we're poisoning my main guy, but he can counterattack. Excellent. He's gonna hobble on back. Okay, now my, uh, my, um... Our, uh, my rogue is there in the way now. Can I control my rogue? No, we go in, in, in turn here. Oh, it is rogue's turn. Okay, um, let's imbue an effect. Let's cripple. Uh, it's already on me, isn't it? But yeah, put it on me. And then we're going to... Um, oh, it's for next turn. Use all my, my points up, didn't it? Well, that was a mistake. All right, yeah, end your turn. And Durin, I'm going to have you move to right. Actually, you can come around the back behind the guy. Um, let's chase this guy down. Hobble on over there and attack that guy. Take that. Yeah, there we go. And not, not much left. Go look over this way. Okay, so I want you to... Um, let's have you step over here. And shoot that guy again. That one right there. Should we do the double one? See if there's a chance to hit. Let's do this one again. We got, we got the PPs left. Let's, um, yeah, PP that guy. Oh, you missed. That was terrible. What did I bring you along for? I should have I put the other archer in. I conjure flames to strike my enemies. Mm -hmm. What are you doing? That guy's already dead. What? <laughs> okay. I'm glad, I'm glad we're saving the wise ones. <laughs> are you listening? What are you going to do now? Oh, you're going to run away. What, what's going on here? <laughs> alright, alright uh, Eshin uh, I don't know, what, I, I can't see my, my hit points, I'm thinking this guy needs healed up here so let's go cruise on up here and heal old, old Durin up here, can you not attack, not attack I want you to uh, do some healing yeah, that one there, and uh, give the guy a make him feel better yeah, yeah, life and forces and all that all better? oh yeah, all better, now he's standing up straight Feels good. Uh, you look that way. Uh, no, no, actually look that way in case he wants to move around and stab you. Fridwi. Get that guy. Rear attack. There you go. That's gotta hurt. Okay, good job. Keep looking at him. I'm tired of being poisoned here. Uh, you have no techniques. You can throw rocks. That's all you can really do. There you go. Give him the shakes. That'll show him. Uh, in your turn, keep looking at him. If the archer is going to shoot him in the back. Okay, I want you. here's what I want you to do. I'm not sure if this is actually a thing, but I want you to come stand right here. Straight behind him. And you, you have room for this? You don't. So we're going to do a standard old attack. Right in his little back. Okay, 37% chance to hit. There you go, 7 hit points. That'll show him. Uh, actually, I guess you should look that way in case he comes around here and wants to hit you in the face. Alright, who are you going to hit this time? There you go. That's more like it. That's more like it. That guy's hobbling away back to his, his boxes. He's putting a healing potion on his head. I guess we can see him because of the, uh, the cutouts, but it's just kind of... It's just kind of not okay. Okay. Uh, Rogue, let's go uh, move up to... Can you move all the way up there? You can't. Um, but I don't, I don't want you in the way, so just come on over this way. And uh, look that way. You can't throw like a uh, dagger, can you? Okay, you're done. Do that. Oh boy, this guy. What's he gonna do? 
That poison is really, really uh, ruffling my, feather, my feathers. Oh, let's go this way. Hobble on over here. I'm not, you know, that hurts. Stop whining, buddy. Uh, I'm going to attack that guy here. This, this view is much better. There you go. Yeah, keep looking at him. Hey, yeah, you. Can you help me out here? No, we can't. Okay, we're going to go from behind. We're a rogue. This is what we do. Attack him in the back. There you go. Backstab. It's got to hurt. Oh, and Clia. Clia, just shoot the guy. The old side attack. There you go. Two points to the face. We could use someone of your skills. You join our cause. That I shall, says Bernard. Oh yeah, we saw you. It was really amazing the way you uh, the way you burned that guy that was already down. I'm quite impressed. All right, we got some cash on these guys. Got some daggers and potions and all that. Excellent. Okay, so we got some skill points here that we can use to spend on things. I think the only one that actually is enough to buy something is Marcus over here. We'll take a look. Between combats here, we'll take a look at what we got. We do have a dagger, though, we can give to our rogue, I think. As soon as it loads here. Purchase items at the shop? Thanks. we Will do. We'll make sure we get that, uh... You know what? We're not using Clia anymore. We're, giving, we're getting the other guy in there next time. You missed one shot, you're out of the party. Okay, so we got a few more things we can go to here. We've got spots we can stop at. I'm gonna go and check out the rest of the stuff, though. So we can go to the shop and buy things. Let's go look at that first. Um, let's... Oh, can we sell things, too? We picked up a, a dagger, right? Range 1, armor penetration 2, damage 3. Is it better than what we've got? Let's take a look. Let's go to the roster and see what... Uh, what was it? Frithwi. What do you have? You have an amulet, apparently, on you. You have a brown tunic. Can I change that? No. Uh, you do have a wooden, a wooden dagger. What? Well, put the get the one. This is a metal one in there. Okay, there you go. Do you have two daggers? You can. No, you cannot. Okay, bronze dagger. I think that's a skill that you can get. So if I can come in here, I can learn skills. Um, I guess she. Oh, she doesn't have backstab, does she? Yeah, because dagger proficiency is mastered, but this one is not. Maybe she has it, but she doesn't have it. You know, ranked up enough. There's an improved backstab as well. If we had these uh, these skill points, we could buy all this stuff for her. Um, also, some powers. Cripple. She has cripple. That's her one thing that she has that she put on her uh, her dagger that one time. We can give her exception. No, not quite. Um, greater cripple, though. Um, oh, no, we can't. Uh, let's see what we can do, though, with, uh, with everyone else. Um, we know this guy had some points to spend, right? He's got 229. Um, so we can actually go in there, and we can we can also like multi-class the guy. He's a he's a, a defender right now. He's level four defender. But if we want to spend points, though, we can actually make him into like a, a defender rogue, I guess, if we wanted to, or a defender wizard. It'd be weird. Uh, and then he would learn different powers. This guy, I think, already has most of his stuff because he's sort of a hero. Um, I'm sure he's gonna die pretty soon. Uh, let's go look at uh, the shop, and uh, let's buy some things. I would like to buy a new sword. Can I have a... Uh, how much do I have? I got 1,200 bucks. Oh, well. Okay. I want a big sword for the main guy. Can I have, like, a, uh, a bronze great axe? I want that. Yes, one, please. And, uh, oh, mounts. Mounts. I can buy a horse? Requires requires combat horse riding. Oh, that's cool. Uh, and there's health potions and things as well, but we don't want those. Um, a blue feathered hat. Oh, we can walk into here and be fancy. Um, a tricorn. Yes. We need a few of those. Okay. Okay, now let's go back to our... Um, oh, by the way, we can also do some like training for our people. Just sort of like learn how their abilities work and all that. Um, but let's go and make sure that everyone's wearing the right headgear. Durin. So I got you a new... Um, I got you a tricorn. Oh, it actually shows up on your person? Excellent. Uh, I got you a, um, that sword, put that away, get yourself an axe. Okay. You, you have proficiency for it. Can I give you a skill with 100 points? You have that counterattack and all that. I mean, I guess you do have some... Oh, that requires 150 for that. For proficiency for it. So I guess maybe you don't actually do a lot of damage with it. Because you're not proficient with it. Uh, I don't know. There's our throw rock, which is ridiculous. 
Um, so yeah, there you go, Tricorn. Um, hey, hey, you, you too. There you go. Excellent, excellent. Anything on your neck? I don't have any extra gear laying around. Um, retire you for some reason if I wanted to do that. Uh, there we go. Yeah, look at the hat. That's fantastic, Marcus. Get yourself a hat, buddy. There you go. Much better. Much better. Okay, um, let's go, I guess, go to... we got Trade Road or Ruben. That's an optional quest. Let's go to Trade Road. We'll see what it is. Apparently, we'll need to stop in the uh, Bandit Hideout. Or whatever this was first. This is another combat. Uh, so I'm going to put you... I don't know which one's front. I'm going to say that that's front with your, your new axe. Uh, maybe this is front. Okay, um... Fine, Marcus can go there. Um, Clyde, I wasn't going to put her in there, but she's got a fine hat now, so I have to. And then um, Bernard. You know what, buddy? Get in there. And then front, very front, we're putting in uh, Gwen with a mighty staff. Okay, let's see what it is first. It's, I guess this is just some sort of random encounter. What do we have here? Bunch of bandits. I think so. Bandit, uh, we're in Bandit Pass. We have to kill all bandits. That makes sense, I suppose. If I was a bandit, I'd, I'd live in Bandit Pass. You'd think you maybe should change the name of the place. You wouldn't have such a bandit problem. Okay, well, anyway, there's Tactics 5, Tactics 5 Obsidian Brigade. It has been out for a little while now, but I thought we should take a look at it. So thanks again for watching, and I will see you next time.